So I always make it point when I start a show that I go in and I say, I'm not a vendor. I'm not just a makeup artist. I'm here to assist you with anything else. And a lot of the time, I'll end up working very closely with the AD department. That's the assistant director's department. I work very close with all the actors. My arms stretch very long in a production, and, and I do far more than maybe what a uh, the normal makeup artist might do on a show. It's sometimes people will just focus on their world. Because I'm a film fanatic, I'm a complete cinephile, that I love everything about movies, and I want to know everything about movies, you know, and how they're made and behind-the-scenes stories. And I've been paying attention for 38 years. That's as long as I've been doing this. And I really make it part of my life to, you know, assist every department. There is a movie I did called The Chronicles of Narnia, The Lion, Witch, and the Wardrobe. And I decided on that movie, I wanted to do spend one day doing everybody's job. And I did. I did one day, including catering, and I made breakfast for 1,200 people at 3 a.m. in the morning. And I did everybody's job. I might have not done it well, (laughs) but I did it. And I knew I could. And it was really, really super fun. So, you know, to me, that's also, you know, a sign of somebody who hopefully, you know, would become a good producer, knock on wood, and having an understanding of every single department and what their needs are and how to facilitate all that. So I'm referred to on set a lot of times as the producer who's not a producer. And people will come to me and ask me every question. Actors will come to me and ask, you know, this, that, and the other thing. And I'll say, well, I'm not really a producer, but I'll act as a producer right now. So that's what I do. It's There's a lot to it, but I take that upon myself. It's not like a makeup department head in the Webster's and it says all this stuff. That's me developing the way I am. And Greg Nicotero, who's my business partner and best friend for decades, a business partner at K&B FX Group, same thing. You know, he's always been that way, assumed more responsibility than required. And he's moved up to, you know, being a, a big director and an executive producer and a writer and a showrunner. So it's really, really great. But we have those natural skills and not everybody has that kind of alpha leadership quality about them. Subscribe to Outliers with Daniel Scrivener now in Apple Podcasts, Spotify, or wherever you like to listen to podcasts. And be the first to hear about new episodes and receive exclusive content by joining our newsletter at outliers.fm. I can't wait to help you level up and live your best life. <laughs>